On May 18th, 2024, the first fight in 25 years for the title of undisputed world heavyweight champion took place in Riyadh between WBC belt holder Tyson Fury and WBA, IBF, and WBO champion Oleksandr Usyk. Looking ahead, I would like to note that the fight fully met our wildest expectations. And there is hardly a fan who did not like the fight between the strongest super heavyweights of our time. The situation before the fight was expectedly tense. The charismatic native of Foggy Albion was true to himself, maximizing excitement before the upcoming event with fiery speeches. Fury then started an old song about his greatness, convincing everyone of an easy win against the boxer from Ukraine. Then he became incredibly serious, noting both Oleksandr's achievements in the professional ring and his extraordinary boxing qualities. Oleksandr, like a samurai, remained calm and taciturn, promising only that he would dedicate the victory to the people of Ukraine. Only two things were crystal clear. First, Fury was never able to get into the head of the Ukrainian as he knows how and loves. And second, the Briton really was in excellent shape, which many of his ill-wishers doubted. The traditional face-off is also worth special mention. While Oleksandr peered intently at his future opponent with an unblinking gaze like a cobra, Fury didn't even think about giving the Ukrainian even a little attention. He smiled radiantly at the fans and radiated incredible positivity, but he never even spared Yusik a glance. Why didn't you look me in the eyes? Have you seen him? He's very ugly, the big British guy joked in response to a question from a journalist. A curious incident also occurred at the weigh-in. Tyson's scale pointed to 262 pounds, his lowest weight in four years. And Usyk weighed in at 233 pounds, which was his career high. Naturally, this could not but cause concern among Oleksandr's fans. But it soon turned out that the legendary Michael Buffer was mistaken, confusing the numbers, and the real weight of the Ukrainian was quite standard for him at 223 pounds. The whole world held its breath in anticipation of the main boxing event of the last decade. Yes, he will. pompous, spectacular entrances into the ring by both boxers, the announcement of everyone involved in the event, a brief parting word from the referee, and away we go! The speed that the fighters demonstrated from the very start of the fight pleasantly pleased the fans. Usyk was more active, working as number one, and the Briton focused on careful boxing from the distance. The predictions of Tyson's ill-wishers, who wrote him off after a bad fight against Francis Ngannou, were ground to dust. Despite his impressive size, Fury easily moved around the ring, successfully used the jab, and worked well in body defense. After a tense opening round, in which it was difficult to give preference to anyone, from the fifth round of the fight, the advantage of the British giant began to emerge. His blows were more accurate, and the force of his blows was clearly felt. Several times, Oleksandr was noticeably stunned. In particularly painful were the blows to the body, which Fury wisely focused on, with the goal of getting his opponent out of breath and slowing him down for the later rounds. Usyk's fans were noticeably depressed in the stands and in front of the TV, computer, and phone screens, and the fans of the Gypsy King were contentedly rubbing their hands at these moments. When it seemed that Fury would confidently bring the fight to a victorious finale, the eighth round came, in which Alexander increased the pace, which was a real shock for his opponent. And in the ninth round of the fight between the two greatest heavyweights of our time, an episode occurred that predetermined the outcome of the fight. Yusik gave the giant a great shock, forcing him to go into survival mode. And just before the gong, 
the referee counted out a standing knockdown for the Briton. Thus, in the ninth round, the score was 10 to eight in favor of the boxer from Ukraine. Both boxers really fought the championship rounds like champions, giving it all their all. A fierce, equal, intense fight between two ring warriors in which it was difficult to determine the winner. The final gong, the happy smiles of the boxers, hugs and mutual congratulations. The judges' scores eloquently reflected the nature of this difficult fight for both guys. 114 to 113 for Fury, as well as 115 to 112 and 114 to 113 for Usyk. In the fight between two undefeated ringmasters, the Southpaw from Ukraine got a well-deserved victory. It should be mentioned that Oleksandr held a similar title in the cruiserweight category. Thus, the Ukrainian completely repeated the achievement of the great Evander Holyfield, who, by the way, predicted Oleksandr's victory before the fight. Now, with a high degree of probability, a rematch written in the contract, tentatively scheduled for October, awaits us. However, everything can change. These guys had an incredibly difficult and grueling fight, receiving huge damage in it. And it is possible that both fighters will have to lick their wounds much longer. So the rematch may take place much later. If, for some reason, the rematch falls through, the guys have other interesting options. This includes Anthony Joshua, Joseph Parker, and even the winner of the fight between Deontay Wilder and Zhang Gillet, who will determine the strongest on June 1st. In the meantime, both participants in the last fight deserve a long rest. Sincere congratulations to Oleksandr Yusik. And according to this author, it is his compatriot who should now proudly lead the ranking of the best boxers, regardless of weight category. Honor and praise to Oleksandr and Tyson for the fact that, despite all the difficulties, they finally had the fight to identify the undisputed leader of their category. The last fight was one of the best events in the royal category in recent years and clearly satisfied the taste of even the most demanding fans. And for this, the author of these lines personally says thank you to both participants of this mega fight. Yeah!